are the questions for practice exercise A found in your module number one. Here, we are tasked to make sense of these groupings. Groupings in mathematics are called sets. In short, we are to make these sets with sense. As you have noticed for number one, at first glance, you might not know, we might not know what are the relationships. But since set is defined as a collection of unique and well-defined objects, we need to make sure to define what is the commonality of these sets for us to, to be convinced that they are actually sets. So looking for number one, we have the items, but we have the objects, banana, mango, pencil, and star. Again, at first glance, we don't know what are their commonalities. But looking at them more critically, we might know their commonality. And it is that all of these four objects are commonly yellow colored. In short, to answer for number one, this is the set of yellow colored objects. The purpose of defining or making sense of these groups will tell us that they are really groups in a group or in a set. Number two, we have pink, purple, paper, peach, and pencil. Let me recall all of these words are found in the activity number one of your module number one. Their commonality is that all of these objects starts with letter P. So the set is called set of words. Let's start with P. Number three, orange, August, umbrella, and apple. Here, this set is defined as a set of objects with names. Let's start with a vowel. For number four, book, math, pink, star, July, jade, and ruby, we are going to accept if you will answer that these words or this is a set of objects with names that starts with a consonant. That's acceptable. But you could also say that it is a set of objects with names that ah, set of objects with four letters in the name, or how do we make it better? Set of objects with four letters in their English name. And finally, we could also say number five as any set you want, but to make it clear, for us to have the same answers with your key answer, this is a set of objects with letters A and G in their name. So the goal for practice exercise A of module number one is to make your sets with sense. Again, you need to make your sets with sense so that you can consider it as a set because we define set as a collection of well-defined and unique objects. 
this is the content of this video. Hopefully you've learned something and see you next time.